Welcome back to Diabetes Every Day. I'm registered dietitian, nutritionist, and certified diabetes care and education specialist, Toby Smithson. If you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and log on to my diabeteseveryday.com website to sign up for my newsletter. There's a lot of talk about supplements. Should I? Shouldn't I? Will taking this or that supplement harm me? Or do I need to take this or that supplement? The quick answer is that we want to choose food first to supplement our nutrition profile. But there are a few, and I want to talk about one vitamin that you may need to take as a supplement. And just as a note here, make sure to check out my video on magnesium. Okay. The big reveal is that the vitamin we will be talking about today is vitamin B12. I'll fill you in on why this is something for people with diabetes to pay attention to here in a minute. Let's start with the amount of B12 you need. The recommended daily allowance for B12 is 2.4 micrograms for people, males and females, who are aged 14 and up. Now, this is a tiny amount. If a 15,000 pound bull elephant represented one gram, one microgram would be a nickel. But our failure to get enough B12 can have severe consequence, like nervous disorders and dementia. B12 is some powerful stuff. Why am I speaking to people with diabetes about this? There are three big reasons. One, research has found that people with diabetes, both type 1 and type 2, tend to be deficient in B12. Number two, if you are taking the medication metformin, which is the first line of oral glucose lowering medication for people with type 2 diabetes, it increases this risk. A recent study published in the Journal of Human Nutrition and Metabolism found that vitamin B12 deficiency in over 17% of people with type 2 taking metformin. And the risk for deficiency may increase with a longer time of taking metformin and a longer time of managing type 2 diabetes. And then reason number three, if you are following a plant-based eating plan, you are missing out on the best sources of B12. Vitamin B12 is found in fish, meat, poultry, eggs, milk and milk products. Clams and liver are the two highest sources. If you follow a vegan eating plan, you are limited to fortified breakfast cereals or nutritional yeast products, fortified almond or soy milk, tempeh, or vegan mayonnaise as your sources. Those who follow a vegetarian diet can get a larger dose of B12 than the vegan options from plain low-fat yogurt, low-fat milk, cottage cheese, or Swiss cheese, and eggs also have a small amount of B12. If you think you need to take a supplement, please talk to your doctor. As a little personal note here, I follow a plant-based eating plan, so my doctor suggested I take a B12 supplement. After taking the supplement daily for a year, my doctor ordered lab work to check my B12 status. The result stated I was getting too much B12, so, my doctor suggested that cutting back on the supplement to every other day. There are no screening protocols, so this is a question you may want to present to your doctor. Ask for some lab work on B12. Are there any vitamins or minerals you are curious about? Let me know in the comments below. Until next time, cheers to your health.